question is like if we're if we're so interested in combining liberal arts and STEM, what's the one elective every student should take? So that means that's a new elective. That's not one that we have from the old days. What would that look like? Bracken. You know, I, I actually, um, I, to Jackie's point, I, I think this, this idea that, you know, if you really, this is just a personal view, of course, but it seems like we've kind of gotten here uh, walking backwards into the future. You know, we're, we're now talking about STEM versus liberal arts, not becoming a, a, a better, more productive person, which is kind of an odd thought. So, so we're, but we've got these groupings now. So, you know, I, I, when I walk into bookstores, I, I'm, I'm always struck by how many books there are, self-help books there are about getting things done, goal setting, you know, everything you can think of. But there's no college, I don't remember, a, a, at least there wasn't on my, in my college, there wasn't a class on, on getting things done. How do you get things done? I think engineering people learn that more. Engineering, the STEM sciences often get that, learn that better because of the process. But, you know, and, and that's one of those, for all you liberal arts majors out there, learn to get things done. Learn to set goals, learn to accomplish them, learn to set milestones. If you don't, your life won't be nearly as rich and as good. So I think something on how do you set goals? How do you set milestones? How do you get things done? Maybe this was the domain of religion you know, 30 years ago, and it's gone now. But it just seems like a whole. Well, it's almost like if you have a team, team classes where you keep putting people together from all the different things, and you guys got to get things done together. <laughs> and there are many different aspects to it. Maybe that's part of the learning to, to actually very specifically design to do that, something like that, something along those lines. Um, where is the